Hello Cancer, welcome to your reading on how you will find love on June 2021. We're using today the Romantic Tarot deck and let's jump right into it. So in the first position here, that tells me where you are right now, we have a wonderful card, which is the Judgment. Beyond the Threshold. It is time to decide. Either the heart or the mind will win. If there's already been a choice made in the past, it must be followed. It is the point of arrival. So here you see the Angel of Venice, you know, opening the carnival. This means, Cancer, that if you have a destination in mind, now you are not giving up on it. You have your point of arrival, you know where you want to be in a certain moment of time and space. And that's what you're doing right now, going for it. Very good. Here in the second position, which tells us the kind of love that you need is the Ace of Pentacles. It is the copper coin. This is the moment of waiting. Just look around. It should suffice to seek love among many loves. It is the card of solidity. So this is exactly the kind of love you need. Uh, down to earth, real thing, nothing like, you know, fairy tales and ribbons and whatever. You really need that down to earth, real person, you know, really grounded person. Here in the third position, it is what you must express in this relationship or what you must express to find love. This is the star. In the Romantic Tarot deck, it is the shining star. You see in the middle here, there's the light shining through the shadow of two lovers. So, no one is alone when the stars are shining. It is necessary to have trust in the celestial forces that reward courage. This is the card of hope. So, I don't think that maybe this is about you, but maybe the person that is in your path is someone that was hurt and, you know, it's lacking a little bit of hope. So what you must express to this person is that the light is shining, the stars are showing the way, no one is really alone. So, you know, to have hope, in better times and see the bright side of things. Here in the fourth position is what you must give to this relationship or what you must give in a situation where you will find love. This is another major arcana which is temperance. The temperance here in the romantic tarot is the chalice. The art of knowing how to adapt is always useful in love. To do so, however, you must be compassionate of your neighbor's misfortunes. It is also a card that means healing. So, you know, when you see the, the glass half full or half empty, you know, you must be flexible. You must understand that if you are in a lucky strike, some other people might be in a moment of bad luck or, you know, having some difficulties in their lives. So, this is the card of adaptability. Okay, so what you must give, I think that this is the balance that you must give to this relationship, you know. Uh, when one person is feeling down, the other one is going to lift this person up. Or one person maybe be good at cooking, but the other person is good at cleaning. So, you know, balance, balancing, adapting, being flexible in this relationship. And in the situation also, I mean. 
Here in the fifth position is what you must take from the situation to find love or what you must receive inside this relationship from the other person. And this we have, in this position, we have the fool, which is the dandy. Blinded by love, he doesn't think and goes on his way. Irresponsible and jovial, in total abandon, relied only in his instincts enthusiasm. So, I think that you will be receiving a lot of, you know, jovial energy, this person that is light and has a lot of enthusiasm. And, as we said before, if this person was hurt before and with hope and flexibility, maybe this is the transformation that you're giving to this person that it's going to come back out back uh, to you so you know the good energy that you give is coming back to you very good another sign of balance and flexibility in the relationship in this sixth position which is the outcome of how you will find love in june of 2021 cancer is the six of pentacles and here we have the painter you know the painter he is in this street market in rome um, and it is telling you that sometimes it is better to abandon the old road and venture into an unknown world therein lies the difference looking at a word that you have never seen before Sharing, it is the card of sharing. So, the outcome here, how you find love, is actually a little bit of a challenge for you, Cancer, because you are abandoning the old ways. You are entering a new unknown path. So, you have to look at things in a new way, you have to face new situations, new experiences, and you will find love. So abandon, you know, the devil you know, <laughs> and this is asking you also for a little bit, you know, of that leap of faith, especially after you saw the fool right here, right? The bottom of the deck, which is a little bit of the overall energy of your reading and also I like to understand this as a little bit of advice from the tarot deck in this reading. So here we have the five of wands. A five, the five of wands is the card of a marriage of interests. No, don't worry, you're not marrying someone because of their money. It doesn't mean that. This means that the interests of both people are marrying together. So, the heart plays and laughs only when it finds its mate. The solitary path brings no joy, only fatigue. So, here we have the advice of the tarot and the overall energy see what it fits your situation it is telling you that this marriage this love this other person is actually someone that has a lot of things in common with you so maybe uh, even if this is a new path is a completely new situation in your life new experiences in your life but this person actually is a lot like you. So I asked uh, for a little bit of advice from the Under the Roses Lenormand Tarot deck and it gives me the whip. The whip is, can be considered as a card of suffering, as a card of repetition, uh, I mean, uh, re um, activities, rep repetition of activities, you know, exercising, but it's also a card telling about us about sexuality. So, seeing here that this person is having a lot of things like you, I also think that you have a lot of harmony 
an energy in the sexual uh, side of this um, commitment, of this relationship. And now let's ask a little bit of advice or clarification to the Romance Angels Oracle cards. So please, Romance Angels, tell us a little bit more about the love that Cancer will find on June 2021 or give us some advice on how to find love in June for Cancer in June 2021. Very soon clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now so i think cancer that you have already decided what or where you want to go what your desire so you see now it is very soon it is coming to you okay so don't try to rush things and don't don't dramatize or get into despair because this person is coming to you, is going to cross your path, okay? So thank you very much for watching Cancer and see you next time!